वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल नमस्ते वेलकम टू डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सी एस सी लेट्स हैव ए ब्रीफ ओव यू ऑफ वॉट इज डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सी एस सी एंड वॉट आर इट्स माइल स्टोन एंड हाउ स्टूडेंट्स एंड स्टाफ एट डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सी एस सी आर गोइंग टू एन्जॉय द सेशन एट डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ सी एस सी प्लीज वेलकम टू सी एस सी block of cac department building where students and staffs enter into the department and they would like to enjoy the ambiance of department of cac and coming to our vision and mission of department of cac so we being the globally recognized center of the excellence having on into computer science and education catering the needs of industry and research and coming to our mission to produce computer science graduates with sound subject knowledge and to technical skills and extra curricular activities let's move forward and this is our entrance of our csc department building block so let's move on with our department of csc office room where the entire files the documentary reports would be gathered here so any information related to your academics to related to your activities or the circulars you know the academic files will be stored in the department and you will have staff who will be guiding you for all kind of services from 24 into 7 365 days and for any kind of updates i request all the students to please go to the notice boards which is very important thing because what are updates or what are regular activities we do keep up in the department will be placed on to the notice boards yes we'll move on and these are the department cabins we start off with the head of department cabin then followed by the other cabins of all other faculties let's get introduced to our head of department of csc we have sujana madam who will be there assisting you guiding you motivating you for all 24 by 7 and we have sujana madam and this is the cabin of your head of department of computer science and engineering so we have hod on the desk so i welcome all to head of department csc and this is the hod cabin and happy to see you madam so definitely you will have good handful session from madam also very soon yes let's go through it let's also get introduced to our uh, research workspace let me give you some glance about the research workspace we actually make students to do internships and also the academic project as part of regular activity and this is the space which we allocate to our students let's get it so this is a kind of workspace which we allocate to our students so that you know they feel comfortable we introduce them the corporate lifestyle from the day one itself so they will be comfortable with working here for 24 by 7 they utilize the services they we, we do provide them the internet facility with all kind of support to do their internship project and also major project work so let's move on to our library have a central library and also digital library which serves us 24 by 7 apart from that department of csc is also giving a provision for department library for all the staff and students let's get into our library and we also have regular updates from student activities these are all the student activities and their achievements as part of computer science engineering department let's see our library and this is a place which i love a lot because you know this is a point of source of contact of sharing knowledge and also getting into your different journals and also books and we department of csc is providing the facility of digital library and also with regular updated versions of books for different subjects and we also put the sample project report corpus which would help out the students 
and this is a project report copy which has been submitted by a department of CSE students and this is how we ask the students to submit on end of the day. This is a project report as a proof of documentary work which they submit in their final year semester. So I hope you also come up with this beautiful binded copy project workbooks as part of your final year second semester and these are all the proof of documents, academic tier wise. We also select the best projects and best internship work done as part of industry and academia. And we also have provision for students to go through different books. If they have any doubts, we do even have faculty members guiding you, helping you and solving all your queries as part of your different subjects. Uh, as part of uh, CSE department, you also have provision to utilize the seminar hall. We have a very spacious seminar hall uh, because we regularly conduct uh, workshops, webinars, a faculty development program and student activities. And this is a seminar hall which uh, you know students can use it for different activities. And you have a big seminar hall with a very spacious capacity and this is a kind of city order. And you have projector facility with all the sound system and all internet connectivity and uh, for any kind of activities you know we do conduct our tech first and we could conduct our meetings student meetings so we utilize the seminar hall for all kind of activities department of CSE computer labs because this is the most lovable place to a lot of students and also faculty because you know if somebody asks what you have in your computer science department, we all tell we have computers, we have laptops, we have desktops, yes. Then what do you show us when you come to labs? Yes, we show you everything in the form of computers, right? We show you everything in the desktop. And this is the computer science lab, which will be working here. You'll be having lab for three hours, and you have very spacious, dedicated lab, and there's a kind of infrastructure which is being provided with high-end configuration systems, you have desktops and uh, you have a processor of i5 and you have uh, other lab with i7 processor with high-end configuration systems, you also have graphic cards, you, we do provide LAN connectivity to all the systems with internet facility and you know this is a place where you know we love to sit here because we are programmers, we are developers, we are coders, so this is a place which we love to stay for more time and this is a place where we you know a lot of students learn their programming skills they acquire programming knowledge as you know you are all aware that you will be having python programming c programming java programming and you will also do your project work and internship work and just 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 let me make a move so this is how the spacious laboratories which are provided to you and this is a kind of infra well so this is a lab with 60 system capacity and you have another lab just beside to this with 40 system capacity. Let's also look into this. So if you would like to present any presentation as part of your internship work or project work, you also have the projector facility where you can utilize all the services for any kind of activity. And recently, uh, you know, our students have also done some workshop. We do conduct hands-on training programs to all the students and staff, okay? So it would be more of hands-on, you know? Morning sessions would be something like a theoretical training session and the afternoon session they'll be working in the lab. So that's how we make students more hands-on on their technical skills and programming skills. So let's enter into the other lab which is just there beside it. And this is the configuration of our systems the hardware and you know the operating system the uses Linux and the software and this is the other lab which we are moving into so this is one other lab which we are providing and uh, there are a couple of instructions to the students so we also request all the students to please follow the instructions when they enter into the lab like you know your dress code or maybe your ID card or maybe your lab record or maybe your observation and you know we make sure that faculty evaluation does in every lab and you know the attendance will also be monitored and there is a kind of workspace and you know the systems 
which we provide you for the students and we'll also show you some sample records as part of student work so this is the kind of student records which students do maintain and this is a record for data mining so students do maintain records and this is how they you know everything would be monitored so you also are supposed to write the index page then followed by you'll be doing all the programming job and this records will be saved for their reference purpose for the upcoming batches and parallel you know uh, we also conduct some coding contest our students do participate in the hackathon program toycathon program you know there are a lot of achievements from students and they have achieved medals they have achieved lot of appreciations from different entrepreneurs and delegates and happy to share that you know our students have also come up with some startups as part of their incubation work so let's move on. we have gone to our head of department kevin we have gone to our department library we have seen our department labs we have seen our classrooms we have seen our seminar halls now let me give you a glance of what we are going to do for the next two, four years how would be your journey in department of csc for the upcoming four years let's see on please join me Well, so here we are. So at Department of CSE, you are going to have a fruitful sessions, and we hope we do have well qualified faculty from reputed organizations. So almost they are doing their PhD programs in different universities, and I am happy to share that we do have 64 publications in reputed journals and international conferences. and something to be you know uh, highlighted here is we make our students to publish journals and papers in various reputed conferences so we do have 17 papers which is being published for our students and under faculty collaboration so that is something which is to be highlighted from department of csc apart from that you know uh, csc department students are also active in participating on to technical fest events or cultural fest and also sports fest event as you are all aware that we do have a technical fest by name antapragna and department of csc is showcasing their working models and also token of gratitude is being given to csc department on the name of smart village so we the department of csc have come up with a tidy call smart village so how to make our villages more smart than cities right and coming to our sports department of csc is being bagging the champion trophies from past 3 years right this is one of the major achievement from department of csc onto the sports and our students are there across our campus in all the activities so we do have young dynamic faculty who keeps inspiring who keeps motivating students to participate in curricular and also extra curricular activities apart from that we do also invite corporates we do invite academicians to interact with the students and also you know uh, encourage our students to do research work and also some collaborative activity so as part of uh, computer science department we do encourage students in coming up with innovative ideas okay and there are lot of uh, activities which students have taken up and happy to share that our students are provided with stipend when they are doing their internship and then project work right and happy to share that you know students are placed in very good companies reputed organizations you will be surprised to see that students have backed a salary package of 10 lakhs 12 lakhs per annum and there are students uh, let me name them one student by name called kiran you know now his salary package is 24 lakhs per annum you will be surprised to hear okay and there are plenty of students if you get into the testimonials and alumni of our computer science department students you'll be surprised to hear okay we are not 
you know we are, we are on par we are comparative with iits and triple iits nits and top institutions across the globe i would also like to highlight few milestones of department of csc we department of csc along with the students and faculty have also contributed as part of consultancy work okay with mahatma gandhi uh, research institute mtnc re you know uh, we have also come up with some uh, web development projects as part of ankapura nirmal we have done some consultancy work and you know uh, students were also appreciated with stipend of uh, 60000 rupees has been sponsored from the organization and our vice chancellor all also have supported with all the kind of facilities for their accommodation and also their traveling and you know all the facilities in terms of you know infra so in this regards i must also thank our vice chancellor for all the kind of support that sir is providing us and also our administrative officer and our uh, you know academic deans you know the regular contact with our faculty and you know the motivation the kind of guidance the kind of support that they are providing us is really you know appreciated and you know our department of csc along with faculty and students have also given their contribution as part of outreach programs so we have contacted half a dozen outreach programs you know uh, going across to the villages nearby you know our basar and also other places in nearby districts personally visiting the schools government schools and you know and then uh, educating them motivating them on to the computer knowledge developing the basic computer skills you know and that is really appreciated from our students and faculty end so once again i must thank our rjkt management you know the rajiv gandhi university of knowledge technologies management our top level from vice chancellor till our faculty and non teaching staff Uh, you know for all the kind of support that they are providing to our students in educating them motivating them coming up with you know different ideas and you know uh, giving them a fruitful results so i also once again uh, you know say that our students are going with the colorful smile faces when they are leaving the campus so this is all the credit goes to our faculty and also the students for all their continuous hard work and you know working late nights in completing their assignments or maybe the projects or maybe the internships so this is a good sign of rjkt students I so once again once again i welcome all the students of this present first year uh, you know you have a red carpet welcome to department of csc I also assure that you will have a bright career in department of CSC. So once again let me also congratulate all the students who have completed your PUC education and entering into your PTEC graduation. So once again I welcome all the students to our department of CSC. I also congratulate all the students to getting into your graduation professional career. so i wish you all the good luck stay safe stay healthy and keep working hard so thank you all